Note: The following video depicts a specific configuration of the notebook. The same removal and replacement procedures apply to all configurations of the notebook. Removal: Remove the two rear rubber feet and two mylar screw covers from the base enclosure. Remove the 14 6.5 mm P1 Phillips head screws that secure the top cover to the base enclosure. Turn the notebook over and open the display panel. Carefully separate the edges of the top cover from the base enclosure. Lift the front edge of the top cover until you have access to the battery connector on the system board. Disconnect the battery cable from its connector on the system board. Using minimal force, lift the locking bar up on the touchpad board ZIF connector and disconnect the touchpad board ribbon cable from the system board. Caution. Use care to prevent damaging the ZIF connector and ribbon cable. Using minimal force, lift the locking bar up on the keyboard ZIF connector and disconnect the keyboard ribbon cable from the system board. Caution! Use care to prevent damaging the ZIF connector and ribbon cable. Using minimal force, lift the locking bar up on the keyboard light ZIF connector and disconnect the keyboard light ribbon cable from the system board. Caution! Use care to prevent damaging the ZIF connector and ribbon cable. Remove the top cover. Replacement Note: Before installing a new top cover, remove the following from the old top cover and install onto the new top cover. Touchpad board. Place the top cover into position on the base enclosure so that you have access to the battery, keyboard, touchpad, and keyboard light ZIF connectors on the system board. Insert the keyboard light ribbon cable into the keyboard light ZIF connector on the system board and press the locking bar down to lock the cable into place. Caution! Use care to prevent damaging the ZIF connector and ribbon cable. Insert the keyboard ribbon cable into the keyboard ZIF connector on the system board and press the locking bar down to lock the cable into place. Caution! Use care to prevent damaging the ZIF connector and ribbon cable. Insert the touchpad button board ribbon cable into the touchpad button board ZIF connector on the system board and press the locking bar down to lock the cable into place. Caution! Use care to prevent damaging the ZIF connector and ribbon cable. Connect the battery cable into its connector on the system board. Lower the top cover into place on the base enclosure and apply pressure to the edges of the top cover to snap it into place. Close the display panel and turn the notebook over. Replace the 14 6.5 mm P1 Phillips head screws that secure the top cover to the base enclosure.
Replace the two Mylar screw covers and two rear rubber feet onto the base enclosure.